Well, hello there. Thanks for joining us here at Coolest Life. My name is Tony, and I'm here at a big cat sanctuary. We're just outside of Sarasota, Florida. And you can see that's a, that's a big kitty right there. He's about 450 pounds worth of white tiger. Uh, we're going to go inside. they got a lot more here than just cats, but I'm going to show you a whole lot of them while we're here. Uh, ticket prices, $25. Unless you are military or veteran, then it's free. As long as you have an ID. So, looking forward. I'll pay for my wife to get in, but I'm going to be free. Yay. Free is always a good price. Come join us, because you just entered the coolest life, travel edition. Yep, that's a big kitty, all right. Tiger over there. We're gonna go inside and see if we can get a better view. But this is a pretty good view here. Little chain links in our way, but nice of his plexiglass. But we are still outside the park. But uh, looking forward to getting inside. And yes, we are still outside the park because see, this is the way in. And here's some parking here. Actually, there's our car. But this is outside the park. Once you get inside, you're gonna have planks, ways you can walk down through the through the center. But as we're still walking in, we saw this little fella here sitting in the back. Yeah, he's definitely full grown, I assure you. Got a nice mane on him. Wow, that's beautiful. Sometimes you see those lions and their, their mane's a little patchy, not this one. Finally made it inside, and there's a big cat area. We, we were just standing out there. This is kind of what it looks like. Nice wide rows here. It does. It opens at noon, so it just opened about 20 minutes ago. It's not a tiger. It's not a liger. It's uh, something like it's a cross between a tiger and a lion, according to the sign up. But you can see these here. I forget what these are called. Looks like ocelots. Maybe three of them in there. And this here's a Kodiak bear. He's right in next to the fence too. Wow, he's massive. Good sized bear. I don't normally see him quite this this big or, or this close to the fence of those as you should do in zoos. There's some more here. Another one there. The neat thing about these is we're about, I'm about 12 feet from this one. I'm not far at all. So if, so if you're into the big cats, this is definitely a place to be. And there's two here, there's two more over here. There's a big nasty up there. Smoke. Hope that's coming out. He's massive, he's gotta be 800 pounds. He's massive. Got an alligator. Now these fences don't make very good pictures. They need more plexiglass. You see that one over there, and he's got his own little pool here. And then they got one right here, a little closer to the fence. And then over here, they got a little more open area. He's right next to the fence. He's only about 10 feet from me. Good size. Lots of other animals. There's Shetlands, there's Shetland ponies, miniatures. Definitely some camels. That's definitely an alpaca out there to the left. The There's some big ones too. A couple hundred pounds a piece. Some guineas hanging around here. I don't know if this is actually their spot or they just jumped in and out of here. My guess they jumped in and out. Black handed spider monkey. Good looking guy. <laughs> nice little aviator here. Got some macaws. With the red headed ones. Got a cockatoo. And definitely some of those crows are in here. Probably trying to get close to this heat. <laughs> there he lands on them. Ostrich. This is an ostrich. Must be a baby ostrich. 
Here's a white one down here. This is only close because, well, I guess I'm kind of up close. I see it. Oh, you can't have that. You can't have my shirt. There's nothing to eat there. I'm grabbing my shirt. Ow! That's not my skin. They're very coarse, though. The feathers aren't as, aren't as smooth as you think they'd be. One thing I've always enjoyed about coming to zoos is, uh, especially not the big zoos, but the smaller zoos, is you can go into the petting zoos. <laughs> and normally they got tons of goats. I don't see any sheep in here, but I see, I see a whole bunch of goats. This one. You can just freak to them. And they're all around here, too. Like this one. If you want to wash your hands afterwards, though. Because they haven't had a shower since it like rain last. <laughs> so here's in the pet zoo too. I don't normally see these in the pet zoo. Hey buddy. <laughs> Some girl was petting his head. <laughs> yeah, don't touch his mouth though. There's a bird or two walking around, not just a crow either. They got some peacocks running around. I'll put a uh, Right up in here, I'll put a, uh, a link to the uh, one where we saw so many peacocks there in St. Augustine. And yeah, look who I found, just as we thought. This uh, filter on this uh, camera doesn't do him justice. He's not a huge peacock, but he's, he's a good size. Such a pretty color on this one here. His uh, stripes aren't quite as black. He's just real pretty. Doing the uh, off cat feeding. Awesome. You can definitely hear him making some noise there. I'm gonna get fed again. Hey. Wow. Starting to play a little rough, ain't they? Tigers, they're back here behind the liger. You get a better idea how big he is when he's feeding these little people. They're like three feet from him. Big boy. Not a can of as pets, but rather if you are thinking of a new family. This is a uh, lion show. It's already gone for a good video to the shelter. By going to the shelter, I just want to show you your the setup. Area. Not only will you find a great new family member. <laughs> But you will also be saving an animal's life. People here, but we thank you for your attention, that. and we hope. Cool. Right after the show is just outside the show area. Cougar, puma. I think it's actually called a panther. I can't tell the difference. Looks like a mountain lion to me. <laughs> All from the same family. It's a good size, though. It's probably 200 pounds. Good size. Yes. Huge. <laughs> this one here, he's right next to his buddy. He's still next to the fence. And he's a little bigger. We saw him earlier. He's still basically in the same place. Camera doesn't do his justice. He's big. Well, I did warm up some. Uh, it's still breezy, but it did warm up a little bit more, so I was happy about that. Now we're trying to get out of here. Just finished the show. The show was better than I thought it was going to be. Uh, and it being in the big cat sanctuary, just I assumed it was all going to be big cats, but it wasn't. What they have? That cowboy, that farmer guy had a dog, two goats, a, a large pig, and a llama. He, this llama jumped through a hula hoop. A big llama, too. Wasn't a baby. Big llama jumped through a hula hoop. Standards are amazing. Never seen something like that before in my life. But that was cool. But uh, if you get a chance to come down here, 
uh, Big Cat Sanctuary, or just outside of Sarasota. I guess they're technically their address is Sarasota. Thanks, mud. But uh, come join them and uh, pay the money to get in here, or we're gonna let you go. Be sure to like and subscribe, send this to your friends in case they're, especially if they're cat people. They definitely <laughs> need to be here, don't they? Oh my goodness. Eric, a nomadic fanatic, you should come here. I'm just saying. I hope you watch my videos, but he should be here. Um, we'll let you go. Be sure to like and subscribe. We're just out here living. The coolest life.